shall show you mercy. They will bless you with a male child. And I will forever be grateful to the gods and indebted to you. Perform a sacrifice. What sacrifice do the gods require of me? Once you're confirmed to be with child, you shall no longer sleep with the king, your husband, nor with any other man, until you deliver your baby. It is called sacrifice of purity. Everyone that has performed that sacrifice always had their desires accomplished by the gods. My mind is made up to give the king an heir to the throne of Umobasi. If this is one of the requirements to produce an heir to the throne, then I would do it without thinking twice. I am proud of you. You know what is good for this kingdom. Gods, I made it. May I help you? Yes, mother. The queen is with the child. She said I should tell you that the herbal medicine you gave her made it possible. And she said I should give you these gifts in appreciation. For me? Yes, mother. She shouldn't have sent gifts. But thank her for me. Yes, mother. 
May I speak to you in private? Yes, mother. Please tell the queen that she is not to lay with her husband, the king, until she delivers the baby. I'll tell her as you've instructed. Good. Thank you so much. Thank you, mother. been set. with me because I'm so tired and worn out. The only thing I need from you now is just allow me to sleep. For many weeks you have refused me your privacy. My husband, please bear with me. All I need from you is understanding. Okay? Because no. I take it that you are intentionally doing this. We will see to the end of this. Pregnant. Hey, Atiamo! 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 I am a man. I am a man. Olama, this is good news. It's not good news. It's not. News. It is good news. Listen, now your grandmother will be left with no option than to bless our marriage. Mother's place and tell her you are pregnant. Hey, all at ya, all at ya, all at ya, all at ya, speak. May the king live forever. And may the throne of Omar Basiuku, as well as the entire dwellers of Omar Basiuku, be blessed by the reign of King Ndobisi. My king, I have observed you for hours, 
and I noticed you have been in a pensive mood. Common knowledge tells me that my king is bothered. And I ask to know in humility what is bothering my king. Thanks for your concern. Thank you, my king. When am I supposed to visit the Umo Basuku Royal River for the Royal Peace Offering? In three Ekemake days, my king. How many people know that you are expecting? Just you, my mother, and Nancy. Mm. What a good man. Mm. How do you go, ma? I'm sorry. Hi. I am disappointed at you. How could you allow yourself to be pregnant, eh? Mother, it was not intentional. It was not intentional. I'm sorry. If I tell you I am not disappointed at you, then I am lying. I, I, I am disappointed. I, Mother, please don't be disappointed at me, please. Please don't be disappointed at me. Hi, what have I gotten myself into? Because of our Lord, please help me, please. Mother, please. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hey, Nendikonu, Nendikonu. Nendikonu.
Ma, mother, ma, what is it? Hey, yeah, something is not right here. Something is just not right. What is it? Balo saw Jeben and Kezi go to his house now. Just leave everything for me. Leave everything. Just this time be looking at me. They go to Eze's house now. Something is. Hey. Ezim, 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 stand up. Ezim, 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 Do you want to cry yourself to ill health and Madri? It's okay. What is life without the ones we love in it? Mother told me how would I live without this? How? I don't know how. I don't know how. It is okay. I understand exactly what you're going through. I felt the same way when I when, when I lost your father. <laughs> I don't understand. Why am I still in love? Why am I still in love, Mama? Why me? Why is it? Why is it crazy? Why is it? Oh. Hi, Chim. Hi. So, Hi. Who are we to question the gods? Hmm? The gods gives and they take. Hmm? Uh, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay.
Oge. Ola ma. Manuku. Moda. Moda. Ne. Moda stand up. Manuku is calling on. I don't even know. Must go to the farm. Ma stand up, Manuku is calling us. Mama would you ring around? Stand up, stand up. Stand up, she's called. Mama, stand up. What kind of sleep is it that you people are sleeping? Look at the sun is already out. Your mates are already in the farm. Are you not going to go to the farm? So you overslept. Where is your mother? She's still sleeping. I tried to wake her up. I don't know the kind of sleep she's sleeping. Wake her up again. No, no, let me get the basket. I've woken her up. Okay. Manuku Agini, why are you crying? Manuku. Manuku, what is it? She, she's gone. Who is gone? Ma Manuku, wait. Jana VCJ, Your Highness, you shall go to the Royal River <laughs> and return in peace. Do you know why? Great Abalco, please tell me. <laughs> you are going to perform a peace offering for unity and happy existence in Omo Basuko Kingdom. This is your most sacred duty to perform a peace offering to the cause for absolute peace to reign in the land. You already know the requirements. May the gods guide and protect you. Hola. Hola. Does it mean she can't hear or see me? I'm not talking. You like to play? Hola. Mbaku. Hola. Okay. Let me go and get your food. Wait. Mbaku. Mbaku. Eat. 
Mbaku. Mbaku. Okay, Nikwa. Ora konara. Mbaku. Are you sleeping? Mbaku. Mbaku. I didn't touch the dog. I didn't touch the dog. I didn't touch the dog. Manuko, no. What happened? I don't know. I was playing with it just now. So I went inside to get bones for, for, for it to eat. Before I came back, I met it like this. It's okay, my daughter. Let's go. Go. Leave it. Eze's death. Your mother's death. The death of your dog and the appearance of the tiger's canine on your palm signifies something. Grandmother, what? It shows that you have been marked and chosen by the goddess of blood to suck blood for her. How? The goddess of blood passes through Abasuku kingdom every decade. She chooses one person that will suck blood for her. And when this person is chosen, she sucks the blood of people around her, people that are close to her. And then her thirst for blood increases. She goes on a sucking spree, killing people as she moves along. Grandma, are you trying to say that I am responsible for the death of my mother, Eze, and my dog? Grandma, that tell me, tell me it's not true. Mbanu, Mbanu. Please, grandmother, tell me there's a way out. Tell me there's a way out. I cannot, I cannot be killing people. It's okay. There is a way out. You will have to go and have a bath at the Royal River. Then you will be cleansed. And the Canaan mark on your hand will be removed. But grandmother, I heard women don't go to the Royal River. That those who dare go there either end up dead or mad. I have an antidote that will protect you and ensure your safety. Trust me. How long is this going to continue? For the past five months, you have denied me access to your body. Not to talk about enjoying the softness of your womanhood. Five months, you say, but I've been with you for so many years. And I've never for one day denied you any part of my body. Then what is happening now? Patience, my king. Just give me a little more time. Huh? Time and patience I do not have. I am embarking on the journey to the Royal River tomorrow. And I need to make a peaceful journey. Are you giving it to me or not? I'm sorry, my husband. I'll make it up to you. Mm -hmm. 
I want to let you know as the king, I get whatever I want. If that is a sacrifice that I have to pay to have a son, so be it. Drink this. It is very bitter, but you must finish it. The Royal River is not too far from where we are. On your way to the river, you shall encounter opposition by the mouth of the cave that leads into the river. Tell them you come in peace. Tell them you've come to cleanse the mark of destruction that you have been tagged with. Give them the fowl. The minute they allow you entrance, do not hesitate. Go right in. Now you may leave. Thank you. Listen to me, don't go there. Hola! Hola! 
Hola. Forbidden to have a sight of the royal river. Even the pain of the man is not permitted to see the royal river. I know, I know, but I come in peace. That is not enough reason to allow you to enter the king's river. Please, please, I've been marked. I've been marked by the goddess of blood and destruction. That passes through Mwabasyuku once in a decade for its blood tax. Please, I, I don't want to be an agent of destruction to my people. Please. My grandmother said if only I could go into the river and take it, but then I'll be free from this mark. Please. The sacrifice is required before you could be allowed to enter the river. Yes, yes. That, 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 that is why I came with this. Gently for this day, and I'm not going to let this day, this chance that the gods have given me, escape from me. The chance to become royalty. Oh, Yahoo Day! Yahoo Day! Yahoo Day!
this be a human being? Or has the goddess of beauty visited Umo Basuku? You're human? Yes, Your Highness. I am the goddaughter of the Kemma, the village herbalist. The Kemma? How did you get in here? Your, Your Highness, I, I'm sorry. I, I was marked by the goddess of blood and destruction to be a destructive agent to the people of Umo Basuku. Then my grandmother told me that if only I can take a bath in the Royal River, then I'll be free from its mark. That's why I'm here. How did you know you were marked? I Passage to the cave was very scary. It was lonely and dark. <laughs> so I heard. But you made it. Manuko, I met the king there. You did? You met the king? Mm -hmm. He was nice. He was friendly. Really? Yeah. <gasps> Thank God. The mark on your palm is gone. <gasps> Thanks to the gods. <laughs> Ask for any food that you want. I will prepare it for you. Manuku. Hmm? <laughs> Think about what you want. Okay. Um, <sighs> I want okwa. Okwa. Mm. Okwa you shall have. <laughs> But without as well, mm, I'm just joking. <laughs> you, Umar, you are something. You are my most trusted servant. I hope I can say trust you once again. My king, part of the oath I swore as the chief guard is to keep secrets. Whatever the king considers secret. Good. No one must hear about this. Yes, my king. You may go now. Greetings, Palace Guard. 
I hope there's no problem. No. The king requests to see the presence of your granddaughter. Wow. Hola, ma. Hola, ma. The king wants to see you. Why? He didn't see you. My ploy to royalty is becoming fruitful. Followed? No, my king. Good. You've done well. You may leave now. Thank you, my king. I must say, you are outstandingly beautiful. Thank you, my king. Come to your king. been denied the touch of a woman for the past five months. At a point, I lost all interest in women, pending the time the queen would change her mind and let me into her lovely arms. But the burning desire of a woman was rekindled in me the moment I saw you this morning taking your bath in the Royal River naked. Since then, I have found it very hard to take my mind off you. What exactly does my king want from a commoner like me? The pleasures of your touch, the warmth of your womanhood. This all your king requests of you. Well, who am I to say no to my king? Because my grandmother said that the king gets whatever he desires. Your grandmother is right. So, my king, I'm all yours. Very good. I want to assure you, you will not regret this. Now, come. Come to the royal bed and furnish yourself. Stand. Why? Keeping faith. Oh, good. 
person. Actually, I came to know why you've been keeping to yourself these days. I don't understand. I know you understand what I'm talking about. But whatever it is that I've done, it is for our best interest. You don't look happy. What's the matter? Grandmother, I'm not happy. What is it? This pregnancy is already two months and two weeks. And very soon people will begin to notice it. <laughs> is that all? Don't let that worry you. The king slept with you. Didn't he? the pregnancy. Hi, Oloma Asona. Yalata.
elders. You are more just. The foreign investors will be coming back here tomorrow. And up till now, we are here to decide on what to tell them. I ask you, what do we tell them? Your Majesty, the ball is in our court. Since they have decided to site their factory in our community, um, I am of the opinion we ask them to pay 45% of the total profit to our community. I am in support of what you have just said. Thank you. We can use the money that we pay us for developmental projects in our community. Do you think 45% is rather too much? Yes, it is. But we can start from there. See if we can shift down to accommodate them. I think. Uh... Take her to my private chambers. Make sure the queen does not see her. Before that, we were talking about the percentage. I think we must be flexible in our negotiation. Forty-five percent of their profit may be too high. But if they come up with 35%, 30, 40, we will uh, align with them. As Your Majesty, yes. Your Majesty. Subject wishes to speak to the king alone. Speak. Yukumara is my most trusted servant. Okay, my king. Let me wait for you outside the chamber. I have matters to attend to in the past. Yes, my king. I... I am pregnant. For who? For you. 
Are you joking? Anyway, if you're pregnant as you say, go to your grandmother and tell her to give you one of those herbal medicines to flush out whatever you have in your system. <laughs> 